little storm coming in. No severe warning out for it, but um, it's starting to blow up. starting to rain now. No bolts, just a lot of flashes. Impressive looking sky though. I'm gonna have to head down in a minute because it's starting to rain. I haven't seen any bolts, just flashes, so I think I'll just film. Unfortunately, I couldn't even beat this home if I wanted to. That might have been a cloud to ground strike. I actually had some cloud to ground strikes that I actually took a good picture of in the video. It's fickle, but when you when you get the lightning, it comes. It's pretty good. It's still poor now. It's a rain. Some part of the rain isn't that heavy. I wonder if it's going by just to the north.
check the radar on my phone just to make sure I'm at. Mostly flashes, but there were a couple of bolts that I, that I got pictures of that I put in the video for you. comes Abby, right? Right. Lightning seems to be over there. Problem is the rain. The wind is going to blow the rain in here. That's the problem. Watch that flood again. <laughs> it's also just flashes. Yeah, the rain's coming in, unfortunately. Show you what this bad boy looks like on the radar. I can pull it up on the phone. Unfortunately, the rain is coming in here, so I can't really uh, hate when that happens. So like, where do I stand? You know.
All right, I'll show you what it looks like on the radar, I guess. No severe thunderstorm warning for this though, just a special marine warning, but that looks pretty impressive. Well, I think the party's over. I haven't seen much lightning. It's just a rainy mess now, but I got a couple of bolts. I got two or three bolts on camera. One was really close to, fortunately. It's just, well, that, that seemed kind of close. Come on, let's get some lightning up for this damn Rain. I want to see some more lightning. That's what I want to see. I don't know if I got that one on camera or not. That seemed kind of close. The lightning is kind of fickle, unfortunately. It's not not as constant as I'd like. Dry thunderstorm must be nice. Like to have them out west where you have it's a thunderstorm, but there's not a lot of rain with it. Those are the perfect storms for lightning shots. <laughs> but we don't get those over here. That's a phenomenon they get out west. I Man, I can't go anywhere anyway. It's pouring, so I have to wait. So this is over. I can go anywhere. Heavy rain, but I would have liked a little more lightning. I rate this storm about a five, a moderate. It's a little weak in the lightning department. It's fickle. Sometimes it'll put some lightning out, and sometimes it's just it's more rain than anything else, unfortunately. So, just kind of blah. It's just boring. Come on, storm, show me what you got. Don't be a weakling. Just to be another freaking soaker without any, not much lightning. Come on! Sometimes if you tell the storm it's wimpy, maybe it'll put something out. But it's all you got, really? That's pathetic. It's just heavy rain. Ton of rain though, I'll tell you that. This is what the radar looks like now. Actually, really it still looks pretty good on the radar, but it's mostly just heavy rain now. The best part is, is over northwest northern Suffolk, so if you're in Port Jefferson, that's probably where the best part of the storm went. Just kind of wait for this rain to end so I can go home. 
Yeah, it's just rain now. It's just pouring rain. You know, it started out really promising. It looked like we were going to get a pretty good thunderstorm. It turned out to be just a lot of rain. Like I said, mediocre thunderstorm, but still a thunderstorm. We still got to see some lightning. And see something. I mean, it wasn't severe or anything, but the main thing with these storms is just going to be heavy rain. So, and I have to wait it out now because it's still pouring out here. I didn't take my umbrella because I figured, oh, any storm that pops up, I should know by now. These storms, they, they, they just become a rainy mess. You can tell us while, we, while we're waiting, I can show you the flooding. It's already starting to flood already. You can see that. It's the way this town is. That's why I can't go anywhere until this subsides. Yep, it's pouring still. Still pouring out here. Starting to ramp up again with the rain. The rain is light now. You can see we've got flooding here. Again, this is what happens in Mineola because there's no drainage. No drainage. Well, at least there's a great here. It's a little bit lighter, so I think I'm going to go for it. It's actually pretty light now. Let's see, the problem is, uh, we got grates there, but they're cheap. They don't put them on the other side. And see, we got on the other side here a river. You may not be able to hear me because I got the hell of water getting on the microphone, the camera. You can see it's all flooding. You can see it's all flooding out. This is the problem. There's not enough. There's no drainage here. Yeah, you got a you got a couple of grates, but they're cheap. They don't have enough of them. So this is what happens. You get rivers that you can't cross. It could pour again at any moment. I really want to get over to the other side. Let's go. See, and it's impossible. My feet are wet. You can't keep your feet dry in this town because, again. Drainage absolutely sucks. Absolutely sucks here. Look at this. It's just a joke, man. It's a joke. Freaking joke. You can see that just the, inf the infrastructure they have is woefully inadequate for the rainfall we received. And you know, storms like these are going to be more common now. You see they're happening more and more due to climate change. So, luckily it stopped. But you can see there's this is all flooded out. It's all flooded out. This whole street here, Willis Avenue. The problem is they have these drainage grates, and it, but the problem is they don't have enough of them. That's the problem. There should be drainage grates at every corner, and they're not. Problem is, there's no drainage breaks here. It's raining lightly now, but you can see. But look what we got dealing, what we're dealing with here. Because there's no drainage here. There's no. There should be a drainage grate here. Look, we got flooding already into this building already. So I mean, Mineola is gonna flood when we get a really torrential rain, like a foot of rain here, which is gonna happen. Everybody's basements are gonna be flooded. And there's gonna be millions in property damage. And meanwhile, I'm trapped because I can't get across. There's a river here. How am I supposed to cross this without getting soaked? There's no way. There's no, absolutely no way, and it's starting to pour again. So I gotta find some shelter. I gotta find some shelter and quick. Oh man, there's a tree here. This tree isn't gonna protect me too much. Oh, right into this town. Mineola sucks for this. It really does. 
There it comes. I'm going to get soaked if I don't get out of this. Had to run back. I'm trapped here. I can't. I'm trapped in a, in a, this town is flooding. So you may not get an impressive severe thunderstorm, but you're getting to see how pathetic Mineola is when it comes to storms. I could have run across that. That's what I could have run across. I should have run across over there. So right now I can't do anything. Might have made it home and beaten this, but unfortunately it's just pouring again. So we wait. I know somebody will make some snide comment or you're standing under some private property. What was the storm? You can't expect me to be out in it. Right, it's not somebody's home, all right? So somebody somebody will make some snide comment about it. Absolutely pouring guys. I'm trapped here. I can't I can't go anywhere. Oh, Jeez. Yeah, it just keeps building over us. It's a very slow moving line. It's just training over us. I'm glad I found this spot. That's yeah, the most boring kind of thunderstorm. Well, not a flash of lightning, just tons of rain. I don't want to hear any more about a drought after this, all right? Had a very wet summer, all right? Yeah, it's been hot, so that's part of the reason why maybe. Yeah, you can see the waters are, look at how it's flooding. This is actually a good vantage point to show you how it floods here. Oh man, we can't go anywhere. Flooding badly, you can see it. You can see what we're dealing with here. It's just training over the same areas over and over again. And these storms are not moving very quickly either. So that's where you're seeing the flooding that we're seeing. It's starting to slow down a little bit. But it's still really coming down. There's a river there, got a river here. right past the drain. The drain should be way bigger. But again, we're ill-equipped here in Mineola to deal with this. And uh, it's only going to get worse every year. And there's going to be a lot of property damage. It's just a matter of time. And I guarantee that hardly anyone in this town has flood insurance. Because they think it's just a coastal thing, like if you're along the shore. No. Nope. You need flood insurance everywhere now. If you live in Mineola, Get flood insurance, all right? See this? This is why you need to get flood insurance. Oh, is this ever gonna end? There's one last cell, I think that'll be it, hopefully. But just keep popping up on top of each other. It's just, uh, that's what it is. This is terrible, guys. You thought I'm up high enough, so I think we'll be okay, but, uh, Imagine if it just kept raining like this. It, it will happen one day. We're just going to get... It is happening right now. We're seeing a flash flood here in Mineola. This is, this is what flash flooding looks like. This is Willis Avenue in Mineola. It would be the same if we were on Mineola Boulevard right now. It would be the same thing.
just keeps coming. It just doesn't stop raining, man. That's some serious flat flooding you got there. And this has got to stop, man. This is not good at all. Guys, it's still going, man. This is this is nuts. It's just heavy rain nonstop. This is like two to three inch hour rainfalls. It's hitting right now. I'm stuck here. I can't. I can't. Can't leave. That's actually enough for to knock you off your feet right there. Eventually it's got to stop. Well, it looks like the rain is over and we still have a lot of flooding here in Mineola. This is, this is, I can't even cross this. I'm kind of stuck over here because you see this is all flooded over here. This is flooded really bad over here. At least the rain is over so it can kind of show you what a disaster Mineola is right now. And there goes the siren. So I'm gonna have to see if I can try to make it across over here. The water's too deep, I can't. I'm kind of trapped over here. I guess I could go over to Mineola Boulevard. I might have to do that. There's a siren. Somebody might need rescue. Um, it's very possible. This is a bad situation. I can't even get across the street. It's all flooded out, guys. It's just not enough drainage here, man. It's not enough drainage. Wow, the other siren's going off. Trying to kind of trap you. There's a flood here too. I can't. I can't go anywhere. I'm stuck. I'm not gonna walk through that and get my shoes all wet. Ah, Mineola sucks. I'm gonna have to walk back over to Mineola Boulevard because I can't get across over here. Ah, it's a town. This is this is part of the reason why I want to move out of. Still want to move out of Mineola if I could. Because this town is not equipped to handle the climate crisis. And I don't want to live somewhere where my building gets flooded. Oh, there's lightning there. Rockville Center can handle this. Mineola cannot. We're going to have to... Um, I might be able to get across over here as soon as it dies down. Oh, and you can see what the problem is. The drain is clogged with uh, leaves because they don't maintain anything here. I think it's gone down enough that I can, I'm gonna be able to leap across. This is what you gotta do when you live in Mineola, folks. Ah, made it! Yeah, it's flashing going on. I don't know if that's lightning or down power lines. But uh, now I gotta walk around and show you what this town, what happened to this town. And I hear fire trucks I don't know where they're going. But uh, here you go. You can see that street's flooded. That's why I kind of walked back here. And I want to see if the tunnel flooded as well. That wouldn't surprise me if it did. The good news is I'm happy to report to you that the tunnel has not flooded. Sounds like they're going to a garden city. Times like these, I wish I had a scanner. Those first streets flooded, as you can see there. Well, now that it hasn't been raining for 
approximately 10 minutes, things are starting to die down. But again, Mineola is not equipped to handle this type of situation. And it's only a matter of time before there is a very damaging flash flood in this town. And hopefully the village of Mineola is paying attention, and so is Nassau County. You need to fix the drainage here. Because it's only a matter of time, and what's going to happen is a lot of people are going to have a lot of damage to their properties. Because a lot of people didn't think they needed flood insurance. We have flooded some flooded sidewalks too, but I'll just have to walk around that. But, you know, nothing is, nothing is done right here. This is just, this is just a, a disaster waiting to happen. So that will bring this video to an end. I actually see some lightning in the distance as the storm pulls away. But uh, there you go, that's a video. Not a lot of lightning, but a lot of flooding. Not the kind of storm I like at all. Anyway, hopefully you found a way to stay dry tonight. Thanks for watching.